I've explored many themes. Often the, the most interesting things to me are, are from the natural world. It's beauty and often look at things that really interest me and inspire me. Different themes that I've explored are water, uh, streams, pools, peering into the water, looking at stones beneath, trying to capture the movement of water over the, over the top of the stones, the movement of water as well. And also seeds and natural forms. Uh, often I'll go for a walk with the dog in the morning in the countryside, across the fields, gather things from hedgerows, uh, pick up leaves, bring things back to the studio and do some sketches and, and painting and just get myself warmed up into being creative again. The second uh, main project has been Blossom, where I was celebrating Blossom within Derbyshire, within the city of Derby and within the location of Hardwick Hall in North Derbyshire. It's a National Trust property where there's two wonderful fruit orchards where I sat for about 10 weeks painting and sketching the blossoms. My intention was to, to document and draw the blossoms from bud to petal fall and to be there all the way through. Also encouraging the public to paint and draw alongside me and I set up a series of pop-up blossom studios where the public could come and join in the blossom celebrations and respond to the blossoms creatively which was just an amazing experience. I created 20 blossom paintings there and used with some of them the technique with the gold process with gold leaf and oil paints. And then also I made a new discovery, the blank canvases were propped up against the trees uh, on a really hot sunny day and these amazing shadows were cast on the canvases which really interested me and excited me. So I drew over the, the, the lines of the shadows and then used that as a starting point for the painting and then layered the, um, the blossoms over the top of them. So I was quite excited that I found a new way of working as well, which um, I'm really happy with. Some of them were a little more abstract than my usual paintings as well, which um, I, I quite enjoyed. I also love teaching art and trying to encourage people to be creative. I think creativity is part of all of us and everybody needs to express themselves in a creative way. And that sort of really is the foundation of all my projects. I want to share what I'm doing. I want to encourage other people to look carefully, to feel and to celebrate what they're seeing uh, in a creative way, finding their own style, experimenting with different materials and different um, mediums. So that's kind of what's built into, into the work I do. Well thank you for listening to my video, I hope you've enjoyed looking at my paintings and have enjoyed uh, hearing about my creative process. I hope you will have a chance to look at the website and have a look at some more of my work.